Well, good day. Just uh, kicking back at home today. It's a rainy day, which is great. Thought I'd share a really old video I did in 1986, technically, at Queensland College of Art. Uh, it was a little bit thinner then, as you'll see, but um, oh, there you go. Enjoy. Leave comments if you like. Hello and welcome to the Leyland Brothers World. I'm Mike. And I'm Mel. And we're brothers. This week we answer a letter from Mrs. Elsie Fitztwiddle from... Thank you, Mike. I'll just get it. Uh, from Emu Drive, Kempsey, who asks us to show the Seven Hills College of Art students in Queensland. Did you show them where Queensland is? Queensland's back there somewhere. This will obviously be one of the most dangerous missions that the Leyland Brothers has ever undertaken. We'll walk. Walk. We'll yeah, drive. we'll walk. Oh, we'll, we'll, we'll use drive, it. Mike. We'll drive. Okay, we'll drive to the park down the road. Mike, where have you been? I've been looking for you everywhere through this vast, unrelenting bush. Ah, oh, I've just been down the car park, parking the four-wheel drive. Here in the virgin bushlands of Seven Hills, it is obvious to us that this land has never before been penetrated by mankind. Penetrated? <laughs> Shut up, Mike. <laughs> As by Aborigines, Mal, if they used to live here. <laughs> <laughs> See how this twig is broken and this leaf is bent? I wonder what it all means. From a distance we spot one of the most dominant and respected of the college inhabitants, the tutor. One must always treat the tutor with the utmost caution, as he has the potential to either accept or reject the would-be student. Here we see what is obviously the dominant member of the pride, being approached by what seems to be a prospective student. From a hidden location, Mike and Mel have spent many hours observing the drinking patterns of the students. And from the amount of drinking that they do, it seems that they derive their main source of energy from this strange liquid. Mel decides to investigate. Up close, the liquid seems to bear a remarkable resemblance to the water from the River Murray. Mel decides to try the drink for himself. After a short stay in hospital, Mel rejoins the safari. Later in the afternoon, from a high vantage point, we observe a rather strange behaviour. This group seems to enjoy indulging in this peculiar manner, as they look relaxed, tranquil and intelligent. Not at all like the usual student. Amidst the ceremony, some of the creatures can be heard to make strange, stifled sounds. We can only come to the conclusion that this is some sort of primitive language lesson. All we know is that it seems to be a joint effort. Yeah, yes, uh, Mike and I thought we'd just have a cigarette before we continued with our journey, so it's off back to the trek. Here we go. Mike, I told you not to bloody film that, you stupid rotten bloody ripper. Oh, oh, sorry, man. After spending the night in the wilds of the campus, we get the strange feeling that we are being watched. We realise that this is a particularly vicious breed of student. 
the video production group, so we decided to stay put for a while. Well, that was Leyland Brothers World for another week. Thanks, Mrs. Fitztwiddle, for asking us to show you the students of the Seven Hills College of Arts. Next week, we hope to bring you an even more challenging piece of footage. We hope to go to the Queensland University and film and possibly even capture the students of the university. It should be very challenging indeed. Where are the keys, Mike? I've already got the keys to the canoe. Um, can't find the... Uh, lift, lift the keys. Uh, Mike? Mike? <coughs> Wide. Ask the Leyland Brothers, stuffed it up with a four-wheel drive. Ask the Leyland Brothers, the place and when they are on strike. I drive my jack in circles, trying to knock them off their, knock them off their bikes. I love to read the bulletin and watch the ABC. I love to wear my well-informed opinions constantly. All my friends are professionals from polite society. So come and sing the middle class liberal, I've got a home in Beaumont Rag. Come and sing the middle class liberal, I've got a home in Beaumont Rag with me.